The United Nations says reports of increasingly horrifying conditions inside Syria are to blame for a worsening refugee crisis that has now seen three million people flee its borders. The UN Refugee Agency said more than double that number are displaced within the country. More than ever, Lebanon, Turkey and Jordan are struggling to cope with the influx. But many Syrians say it's impossible to stay on. We couldn't take it anymore, from being hungry to being cold, being under siege, being bombarded all the time. We saw people die in front of our eyes because of the bombing from both sides. We could no longer stay there. We couldn't take it. Me, my brother, daughter and sister simply couldn't take it anymore. As the situation becomes more desperate for ordinary families, it appears that officials and smuggling gangs are cashing in as people reach the borders. The journey out of Syria is becoming tougher. Um, we have been told that uh, many people are forced to pay bribes at armed checkpoints, proliferating along the borders, and that the price for smugglers, and many have to resort to uh, the transport using smugglers in order to get out, is, is becoming very steep. The UN admits that the Syrian exodus is its biggest refugee operation ever and has called for more countries to share the cost burden. It estimates a $2 billion shortfall in funding based on current needs.